Hi, Hi guys, guys. Welcome, welcome back, back to our channel. I'm, I'm Natasha. Natasha. I'm Nikita. I'm Natasha. What's wrong? Why is yours so white at the top and mine so dark? Yeah. So they've just tie dyed it and Land they're all different. Yeah. Okay, anyways. Um, Anyways guys, hi, welcome back to our channel and welcome to our channel. If you guys are new, if you haven't done already, make sure you press the like button, hit, hit the subscribe, subscribe button, button and turn your post notifications on so you can keep updated every single time our new faces post. Um, yeah, anyways guys, so sorry we didn't post on Monday. Um, we've had a lot going on with our personal lives. Um, so yeah, but without further ado, um, we're getting there. Um, but before we get into today's video, we are going to do a quote of the day like we do every time on this channel and the quote of the day is If you have good thoughts, they will shine out of your face like sunbeams and you will always look lovely And that was said by Rod Rod Dahl and it's Rod from goodhousekeeping.com Anyways guys, without further ado, let's get into the video Right guys, so if you didn't see by the title, if you don't know the title, you probably did, but you can tell by the title that today we're doing the one dip makeup challenge. This is trending right now. I've yeah. seen so many people do it. Who was that guy that did it? James Charles. James Charles did it and yeah. I loved his We one. saw his video, his makeup his turned out so good. Out so good. And I don't know if mine will. Yeah. So I'm more worried about my eyebrows, I don't know if I'm gonna do it with Yeah, because he but... has he has like naturally lovely eyebrows. Like mm. we've got Thin. like non existent eyebrows. Can't have everything, can you? Good looks, no. eyebrows, you know, you just can't have it all. Um, so we didn't get the good eyebrows, but we're not good with our makeup. So, anyways, um, we're just gonna get straight into it, aren't we? Yeah. If you don't know what the one dip makeup challenge is, you basically can only dip your makeup in um, once. So, yeah. like with foundation, you can only use one palm. Um, with like eyeshadow, you can only use like one swirl. You can use different colours. But you can only use one swirl of a colour. Yeah. With eyebrow stuff, you can only use one bit, etc. You get the point, right? Yeah. So I'm going to I think we're both going to start off with our um, iconic sprays. I guess you're only allowed to do one spray. We're just using the prep setting glow. <clears throat> I guess you're only allowed to do one spritz. So it better be Oh, mine didn't work. What do you mean? Nothing can work. Yeah, I can see some on your face, so you're not using another one. One, one go. Ah, oh, no, my face is so. so I'm gonna start. Well, you're both gonna start. I'm gonna both start with our eyebrows. Yeah, both of us are gonna start with our with eyebrows. Our eyebrows. I always do my eyebrows first. Like, before anything behind my head. Behind my ears, even. Yeah, I always do my eyebrows before anything else. So we both just use. We both use the sleep. Um, sorry, I don't know what it's on. What is this? Um, we both use. I think it's eyelash glue. We both Mine's use got eyelash glue too. Sleep. We both use these sleep pomades. This is what they look like. You can buy them like in boots. That's where we get ours from. Yeah, and we, we use a shade like. dark. Yeah, we use a shade dark. And it just comes with a pomade and brushes and powder. And a little So freezer. I think you're allowed one dip in the pomade and one dip in the powder. Don't know, but I that's don't know. It's it. two different products, isn't it? Is that weird? Yeah. To that? I don't know. So I'm just going to prove that I'm only dipping it in once. once I thought I'm going to try and get quite a bit of product. This is for it. both your eyebrows, though. Yeah. Okay. Right, dipped it in once. It's quite a lot on my Jesus. Holy moly, there's so much on her. I know, I don't even know how. how to start because it's so thick as well. I don't want to put loads. Okay, now we're just going all the way around. Mine's not going too bad. I think it's because I added, I grabbed a lot of product. But that's mine. So I'm just gonna keep doing this. Let us know, guys, if you guys have done this challenge. We want to see them. We find them quite funny. So, you know, we want to support back. So, yeah. Let us know if you guys. Guys, I don't even know what's happened. So that's mine with the pomade. That's one dip with the pomade for both eyebrows. I think that's pretty good actually. The thing is, is Natasha normally uses quite a fair bit of pomade when she does her eyebrows. She uses a hell of a lot more than I do. So I don't really like working with a lot of products, so I don't actually know how to because I never do it. Well, 
I never dip my fucking, I'm sorry. I never dip my um, brush in there like how I just did though. I don't use that much fluid. No, I know that. But, but on both eyebrows, yeah, this is probably about how much pomade I would normally use on both eyebrows. So. I mean, when you have thicker eyebrows, it's just easier, really, isn't it? Because there's not really much you need to do. Like, James Charles has literally outlined his eyebrows. My eyebrows look horrible, but hopefully concealer can save me. So the thing with concealer, we both go, we both outline our thing, our eyebrows. So what are we allowed to do? Are we allowed to use it once for our eyebrows and then once for under our eyes, I guess? That's how it's going to have to be. Mm. This is nothing else we use to go underneath our eyebrows. No. It's just the same product. Yeah. I don't use anything different. Yeah. So we both use the um, multi-use eraser, multi-use concealer, and it's the Anton Age eraser. I've just twisted mine once. I did a 360 twist just now. You oh, probably yeah. heard it in the background. Let me do that because I don't think there's much. So there. you do a 360. Oh, we swear by this concealer. Yeah, by the this way, and really it's good. pretty easy. Well. Yeah, there you go. That was a world class twist. twist. And then we'll do one twist for under our eyes. Yeah, so I cool. basically dig my brush into this and get um, concealer out of it. You can only dip it in once with both eyebrows though, that's the thing. I know, but I'm just trying to actually grab some get the product. product in the Okay, I've definitely got some product on my brush there. Yeah. I managed to get some as well. Oh, yeah, that's how much I normally use anyways. No, I, I usually use And I normally have that. like leftover underneath, so. I usually use a bit more than that. Um, if you guys want to see how we actually do our eyebrows, usually, we do have a, oh god, I just fucked it. Oh yeah, we do have a brow tutorial. We do have a brow tutorial up on our channel. We'll put it out there. Check that out. I know there was some girl, she commented, saying that she was going to browse our channel for an eyebrow tutorial on like one of our videos, and I was just like, oh, we do have one up there. So there is one up there, if you guys want to know. Yeah. But if not, obviously, everybody does their eyebrows differently. That's just how we do ours. And by the way, my eyebrows will obviously look much better than this. And the brow tutorial, well, actually, I'm not sure. They'll probably just turn out the same after I've cut it with concealer. I'm just going to blend underneath. I'm not. I'm going to go in with my powder. So I'm just going to use blend. one dip of the powder. You guys can see... And then I'm just gonna finish filling out these bad boys. Okay guys, so the next step that we're gonna do is foundation. Remember you're only allowed one pump um, for I don't usually use much foundation. I usually just use one pump. So I don't think it's gonna I be... use like three or four. That's one pump. If I'm going for I'm about to take some more. That's why you joking me. That is barely gonna go anywhere. Right. Stop complaining. I'm How is that gonna cover this shit? How I do. Ignore my dark circles. I don't know how concealer's gonna cover that. I literally just put it in the problem areas when I'm not using much foundation. I don't usually put it all over my face, but I try and get it. I'm gonna work in circular motions. I feel like I can get it back further. Make it go further. Okay. I'm just patting mine into my face. Do, 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 do. At least if it turns out half decent, I know that I don't actually need that much makeup. Yeah. The good thing is my skin isn't looking that bad just be using like a tiny amount of foundation so when my skin's looking worse though i don't usually even put a lot of foundation because i feel like it makes your skin look worse you know what i mean i normally put like way more foundation than this like this isn't even yeah and if it usually like delicious. takes her face in it so. i don't take my face mm. I don't take my face. I like a natural look, but... You do take your face. I feel like in the winter, I wear more foundation because my skin's better in the summer. Yeah, but in the summer, in this country, I definitely wear foundation, but when I'm away... I don't wear foundation. I never, like, I try and stay away from it yeah. unless I'm going out for a nice dinner. When I went to Egypt and I wore eyebrows in the sun, I kid you not, my eye, when I took it off, it was so burnt underneath. I don't even know what happened, but it was so burnt underneath. And from that day, I've never worn it. Oh, that was so funny. Yeah. I just don't tend to, like, 
I don't really like wearing foundation as it is. So when you're hot, I just hate putting foundation on. Yeah. Because I know I'm just gonna sweat it off. Right, I think, are you gonna do concealer next? Probably. Or are you gonna do shadow next and then concealer? No, you just finish my base and then go around. Me so. too. Um, okay, so, so that's I'm, what the foundation turned out like, guys. I'm using a concealer. That's how my foundation turned out. How are we allowed to do this? What? With, these, this, with this concealer, because obviously like with James Charles, he has As a tart. The tart and you just twist it and you can only use that. So I guess one twist and you just oh, use Oh, one twist, on yeah. Okay, cool. One 360 twist. Right, and then I'm just gonna Oh, kind of... I don't think it's gonna be enough product for me. Yeah. I use like a lot of concealer. Oh my God, it's more than enough. There we go. That's how much I normally use. This concealer is really good because when you twist it once, so much comes out. Well, not so much. I can use more than this. But I would no never use more than this. Using more concealer when um, I have one. Oh, let us know down in the comments below if you want to see an everyday makeup tutorial because we want to do one and we just haven't really got around to doing it. So just let us know down yeah. below if you'd like to see that or not. And obviously we're no beauty heroes, we just like doing our makeup. Yeah. So next we're both gonna go in with Laura Messier translucent powder. Let me get a bit more out so you I can think that's more than enough. dunk some on your brush. You're only allowed to put one, aren't you? Yeah, so you go first. Oh my god, that's more fun. That's more powder I've used my whole life. Okay. And then I just like to smell it all over. Like this. this is actually turning out way better than I thought it was going to. Yeah, I like how my makeup I thought, looks. My, yeah, I thought my makeup was going to look horrendous. <laughs> anyway, let us know though if you guys have a video because I really want to see people want to get makeup now. That's powder done. Are you going to do bronzer next? We'll do it and then that. I'm going to do bronzer. Yeah, next. I'm doing bronzer. So we just use this bronzer. It's a city bronzer. Well, she has her own bronzer. But I she use my Rimmel like, one because. But it's hip pan. Like, and when I say pan, I mean like it's really hip pan. Like, there is so much product gone. And she prefers mine. And Anyways. I prefer this one. It's a bit darker. Um. So I, like I guess you dark. can just take a swill, and that's enough. Oh, yes. And Nikita's um, bronzer is like, whoa. <laughs> It's very bronzy as well, so for this challenge, it's perfect. I'm gonna use uh, highlighter next, so I'm just gonna go in with this morph. Oh, I'm gonna have to this use yours because my highlight is over there. Has crushed to um, a cinder, but this is morph and it's the color Spark. I really love this highlighter. I need to, to get a new yours. one. Obviously. You should use Mac. All my highlighters are from. Careful. Mac. I don't know why I'm tapping the top. Okay, so one dip, and then I'm just gonna. Boop. At least you don't use any other highlighters but Mac. Boop. We're using this one today. Boop. Boop. Yeah, it's not very uh, And then just blend the rest in the sections that I love. Highlight. We did the 10 minute makeup challenge. We should do the five minute makeup challenge and really yeah, test ourselves. Right, so that's pretty much the highlighter. It's not very good, but. Okay, I'm just gonna move on to eyeshadow next. I'm just gonna do a simple shadow look, probably just two colours and just blend them because you only have to use one dip for both eyes as well, so this is gonna be really, really Hard. difficult. Mm -hmm. Like a mirror that I can use to look at it. Right, so I'm gonna go in with this shade in the Huda Beauty Coral Obsessions. And I'm just gonna take one big swell. Right, guys, I'm using a completely different color. eyeshadow palette. That is one That's of my favorites. I'm going to use my Nubian by Juvian. Yeah, the Nubian by Juvia. Um, it's this one. It's really, really lovely. I love her eyeshadows. I've got another palette of hers. Probably buy more because she's actually, if you think about like how much people charge for eyeshadow palettes these days, she is actually pretty, you know, decent. She's not trying to Ripping steal our money. And That's then right. I'm just gonna dunk in with yeah, this sorry. shade down here, the one in the middle, in the same palette. And that's just gonna go into this. 
So I'm just going in with a golden shade. I don't have the, just, I don't know if there's more of the shades, but I'm just using this one here. Excuse my dirty eyeshadow palette. And to be honest, I'm not sorry because I think everybody has dirty eyeshadow palettes, don't they? So I'm just going in with one swirl of that. And this has to go on both eyes. And then to finish mine off, I'm gonna go in with the MAC Smarty Pants Palette. And I'm gonna use this shade here. And I'm just gonna go in once. I don't know if you guys can see that. It's just a little shimmer shade. I'm gonna dab a bit on each Guys, eye. now this is why I love this woman, yeah? She makes her eyeshadows so pigmented. Thank goodness for this challenge, right? But I'm just blending this all out. This is this I'm just going to take my other Morphe brush and go in with a slightly darker shade. I'm just going to dip it in there like that. That's probably way too much, but this is just going to be like just to define my crease a tiny bit more. Yeah, I'm going to go in with a darker colour as well in from this palette. This is by Zoeva. I don't actually know. Zoeva. Yeah. Zoeva. And I'm gonna go in with Freshly Toasted in this palette. Oh my God. How are we gonna do mascara? You just dunk it in once and put it on my eyes. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm gonna use this Clinique High Impact Mascara. Oh, that's my mascara she's got in her hand. And <laughs> I'm just gonna grab some products <laughs> and I'm just gonna uh, put With lashes while she does her mascara. Um, the lashes I'm using are from our company, AC Cosmetics. We're currently having a 40% off. Humongous sale, 40% off. Yeah. And if you're a makeup artist or, an or like an influencer or whatever, give us a message on our Instagram, which will be tagged down below as well, or email the email that is on our website. We'll and also we put will, it down below. Yeah, we'll also put that down below. And we'll give you guys a special code that you can use, which will allow you to have an extra 50% off. So if you are in any way or influencer, it will be 90% off in total. People are going, people love it right now, don't they? Yeah. The fact that we're doing that deal, so. Right, you're only allowed one dunk of eyelash glue. So I'm gonna have to do both my lashes at the same time. So I'm just gonna put, by the way, I'm wearing the lash um, Crete. How are we only allow one dip of eyelash glue? Because that's the rules of the game. Oh yeah, we don't actually sell um, glue. glue with our lashes. It may be coming. It may be coming, it but we just want to make sure that it's safe so and, and, and like it's that. good and you know, so we're yeah. just trying to be careful. We don't I've had a, like, I've out. had a few eyelash glues, like the one that came with my idea. I don't know, to be honest, whether it was just me or what, because it was, I don't know, every time I would stick my eyelashes on that glue, I would find myself ripping my lashes off at least like some point during the day because my eyes were stinging. I just did one. And while she does her lashes, I'm gonna put my lip gloss on with one. This only allowed to come out of here once. And this is the lip gloss I've decided to wear. This is Bare what Minerals. I? I got this in a set actually from House of Fraser in Guildford. I think I got it last Christmas actually. And it was, it was on discount for like 18 Charlotte, quid. Like yeah, I'm pretty sure. And it was on discount for like 18 quid. And then you have this one, it's called Boss and it's in matte. And then there's the other one. And it I was on discount for more than that. It was like 18 pound and then there was like an extra oh, discount or like something. Because 15 quid or something, I can't remember. That's why you bought it. Cause it was, yeah. so, it was such a good discount. And then you bought that micro, the stuff we use on our skin. Lash isn't really sticking on as well as I would like it to. Like it's hanging by a thread here, so there's not really much to do about it because I'm not allowed to put anyone. Would well, it rip it off? Completely ripped it off. Um, anyways, that's just gonna how it's gonna stay till the end of the video. So this is <laughs> I'm my makeup like, look. I want to use that lip gloss that you use, please. I was gonna use my lipstick, but I don't really see how that works as a one bit makeup challenge. My eyelash is coming off completely. Wowza, look at my eyelash, guys. And to finish the look off, I'm gonna go in with one more spray of this. I put some on the. I feel I like if, if I spray that on my face, it's literally gonna blow my eyelash off. But I'm gonna put some anyways. I'm just gonna. Anyways. Right, so. Is that the final is look? my finished look. This is my finished look. I've um, done more a lot of pink eye. She's not pink eye, obviously, but you know, pink eyeshadow. And she's done more of an orange, bronzy. Yeah. Color. 
By the way, this glue didn't really work on this eyelash. That's why it's hanging by a thread. This is like, and I'm not allowed to put any more on. Um, but yeah, this is our finished look. This was our one dip makeup challenge. This is how my makeup normally looks, so I'm not actually fast, really. Yeah. Except my face does look a bit more flawless because I do wear more foundation than this, but that's okay. Yeah, this is usually like, this is what my makeup looks like. I'm not even gonna lie, not even gonna cap. This is what my makeup looks like. Not the eyelash. I tend not to have my eyelashes just right away. Enough. But um, this is what my makeup looks like probably on my everyday situation. But yeah, so that is it for today's video. If you we guys, hope you have guys tried, enjoyed it. Yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed it. If you guys have tried this challenge, then let us know down below and we would love to check some of your videos out. Um, also, if you haven't tried it, then try, try it. it and that's It's know. fun. Do it with yeah. friends. Do it with a friend, do, do it, it on your own, who cares, like own. it's fun. Um, but before we check out today's video, the quote of the day is... If you have good thoughts, they will shine out of your face, face like, like sunbeams and you'll always, always look, look lovely. lovely. And that was said by Roald Dahl and it's from goodhousekeeping.com. Anyways guys, that's it for today's video. If make you haven't sure done already, make sure you press, press the like button, button, hit the subscribe button, turn your post notifications on. And we will see you guys in the next video, in the next video, in the next video, 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 video. Anyways guys, peace.